In this video, we're going to take a look at setting up social sharing options in Brizzy Cloud. So let's go and set it up for our homepage. Let's go to the CMS tab in the top left hand corner. In there, we can open up any pages or posts and set up our social sharing options. So let's go ahead and set up the homepage. We'll select the homepage from our list of pages. And inside there, we're going to switch over to the social tab. Now inside the social tab, this is where we can get a preview of what our social shares would look like. Now you're probably wondering, where is the information coming from for the title and for the description? Well, this is coming from the SEO tab. If we switch back to the SEO tab for this particular page, you can see I've already filled out the title and the SEO description. But let's say I hadn't done that. What would happen? Well, it would then fall back to the content. Inside there, again, you can see we've got the title and the description. And if it's nothing inside there, it'll fall back to the global setting that is applied to your entire site. This is available inside the project settings underneath the sharing options. You can see I've already gone ahead and put a fallback message description and also a fallback image. So whichever one you choose, there will always be social sharing information providing you fill out at least one of these. So let's go ahead and go back to our homepage. Let's switch back over to our social tab and let's go ahead and upload an image. As you can see, currently we've only got a title and a description. Let's click to add an image. We'll find the image we want to use. We'll choose the social one and we'll click open. So now we've gone ahead and inserted a custom image for our social sharing and everything is in place. All we need to do is click update and that now has set up our social sharing options along with fallback options should we need them.